Exactly. That's just coincidence that he's from, you know, where I rap is. That's not my fault. You know, what are you going to do about it? Do What's up, sir? That? How you doing, man? Doing great. Good to I'm see you, man. We, look, see you too. I've been bragging, you know. I have yeah. a tendency to run my mouth a little bit. <laughs> so I, I've written a few checks that you might have to cash for this week. <laughs> okay. I'll help you out, man. You know Good luck. Keep supporting. Exactly. Put a lot of zeros on them checks. Exactly. But, man, you, you open eyes last year as a rookie. Yeah. You know, the, the shooting, and I think a lot of people feel like, wow, this guy's a great shooter. To me, you opened even more eyes this year with the all-around game. Mm-hmm. Did you go, did you go in the lab in the summer intent on making sure you come back with all these new wrinkles and, and off the dribble game and right. the physicality, finishing at the rim, all, yeah. all that was a part of your summer plan? Man, I honestly, I always stay in the lab. Yeah. And, you know, I was hearing people at the end of last year when I caught, caught people off guard. It's like, only reason he's doing that because Eric's hurt or right. – Brandon's not playing, and, you know, that was kind of fuel to the fire. So I got in the gym. I knew what I was capable of on the court, and I didn't want it to seem like a fluke season. So still out there trying to get wins right now, but, you know, I'm learning. I'm getting better each and every day. Great veterans around me that are helping me too. I spoke to you on the phone the other day about mm-hmm. competing in the skills competition, um, and I started thinking about it afterwards, and I was like, do you wish you were in the three-point competition? You finished third <laughs> last year. I know. Um, I mean, it is what it is. You can't control it, I know. but you can't control it. Um, I, I, I'd like to get redemption, but I'll be back. I'll I'm be pretty back sure I'll get another down chance, the line, yeah. So it, it'll be fine. I'm here to win the skills challenge. So. Yeah. Hey, look, don't start no mess either. Right? <laughs> About what? Just nothing. I, like, I feel like you're attacking Grand Rapids right now. Right? Like you want to say some stuff. So I mean, we should be high. He left Grand Rapids in high school. To, That's not the hey, point, though. It's, it's still not, home, though. Yeah, it's thank still you. Home. Okay. Thank you. See? He's so hot, too. His it's Falcons to lost the Super Bowl, so he's, oh, he's, still he's in his off feelings off. a little bit. Yeah, he's in his feelings a little it's bit. It's a tough one. Um, we, we asked some of your fellow uh, Kentucky Wildcats if there was going to be any kind of reunion this weekend with so many guys mm-hmm. involved. Somebody mentioned that there would be a large bill at some point. That you. It was Anthony Davis. Okay, it was Anthony Davis was saying that you or some of the other young cats were gonna have to pick up. Anthony Davis said I have to pick up a lot. <laughs> he said. He said. Is that what happened? He said there would probably be a, a get together of all the yes. Kentucky Wildcat guys here this weekend, and that they'd probably leave you with the tab. <laughs> so we have Anthony Davis, exactly. like 145. Was it 145? Something, well, we have something John preposterous. Wall here. Yes, John it's Wall is here. Max. What? Demarcus. Uh, yeah. No, I won't be touching that though. <laughs> so. When you come here now, two years in a row, yeah. the next time we see you, it's got to be on Sunday, right? It's got to be as a member that's, of that big game. That's the plan. Yeah. Um, that's what drives me. Being, being able to be around it right now, you know, it feels great and special, but honest, honestly, I want to be in that game. And, you know, I know that comes with winning, too. Um, once, once we start winning and have team success, you know, I think that's what makes players look a lot better. We got a question from a, a viewer who wants to know. Okay. Who's the best dressed between you, D'Angelo Russell, and Carl Anthony Towns? And uh, what do we expect from your all-star wardrobe this weekend? We see you already <laughs> stepping out a little bit. Yeah. I want them to answer that question, who they think is the best dressed. <laughs> they know what each of us is going to say. They have to answer the question. But um, you know, I, don't, I don't have any crazy outfits. So, um, I just have, I have a little appearance I have to go to after this. That's why okay. I have this on. So. Keep little suit. Little Don't suit. even say anything about the Tom Ford glasses. It's just hey, they're just look. glasses. I didn't know they're Tom Ford. There's a, <laughs> <laughs> there's a, oh, there's a label oh, okay, on the glasses. Oh, oh. I didn't know that. Oh. Sorry, it's not on you like that. Look, them booking. We know you no, got a bad, nice man. schedule going on here this weekend. Good luck this weekend, man. Grand Rapids stand up just one more time. You know, you know how we do it.